you will not believe what just arrived! And it sounds like Christmas. Hello my crochet friend, welcome back to another video. This is Bruna Ducality. Today I'm going to show you the biggest haul ever and I have a lot of Christmas stuff inside this box that I want to do for Christmas, before Christmas and also some things that is not Christmassy, it's just for winter time. First let's open it up and have the very first viewing of the box because I always like to open it and see the top with you guys so you can see my reaction because I get super excited and I cannot even handle myself when I'm doing an unboxing <laughs> so let's let's begin let's begin it's beginning to look a lot like Christmas this is my Christmas gift for myself I'm in the mood today. <laughs> oh my god. So, oh my god. This is the heaviest box that I ever got from Tesla. <laughs> So I'm going to be starting with the biggest ones at the top, in which are my favorites. You know that I love the Bravissimo yarn. It's my absolute favorite and I do everything with it. Even if it's not ideal using acrylic yarn for certain things, I always do because I love it. <laughs> so I have some Bravissimo yarn and I have some sparkly ones. So this one, it's the Bravissimo Lurex or Lurex. So it's silver and it has like a sparkly thread going through the strand in which it's so cool. So I got in silver this one and I have two at the top. So I got this one in cream. I have something in mind that I wanna do. That's why I got the bigger ones because I know that I'm gonna be using a lot of yarn. So I'm going to be putting everything here so you can see. And all of these are 500 grams. And this one is in the shade Militare, in which means army green. I've always wanted to have this shade of Bravissimo, so I got it. Some chunky yarn. You know how much I love chunky yarns. I am, super fun of a DK yarn, but when it comes to chunky yarns, they win, they win for me. So they have now the new yarn called Verve, this one, and look how colorful it is. This is so fun and I got in many different shades. I have three different ideas for this, but I'm not sure which one I'm gonna do. This one here is in the shade Creative Vic. That is a fun name. This one, it's in Fluotic, in which is more like neon shades. That is a very creative way of naming the yarns. And this one is Emotic. And this yarn, it's 100% wool super wash. I'm so excited to try this out. It's a very, very thick yarn. I would say that this is a super chunky. So the Bravissimo yarns are 100% acrylic. The one, the Lurex one, is 97% acrylic and then 3% polyester, in which I think is the sparkly thread that I, that I was talking about. If you are wondering, I cannot wait to try this out. Look at this, it looks like cake. The colors are incredibly beautiful, look at that. So this is another super chunky. This one is the Master. I do have already some of this yarn at home and I am doing something with it. I really, really liked it, like super liked it. I've decided to get some more. So I got in this shade. This is in the shade. Oh, I don't think I'll be able to, to see it. Oh, it's in the shade Disco, Master Disco. Oh my God. 
and I got a lot of these and this one it's 52% wool and 48% acrylic. I love when it's a mixture and also super chunky so I got I think I got two different shades or just one I don't remember now. So I got some more Verve in different shades. I got this one in Fantastique. I got this one in Fablique. I love the names, that is so fun. Fablique, another one. Everything that I'm showing to you guys in today's video, everything that I bought will be linked in the description below. So feel free to check it out. I'll leave the names, the shades, and everything that I got in the description. Next up, we have something that I've always wanted to have. It's a wool unwinder. We will have to try this in today's video. Just like a little sneak peek, because I'm so excited. I've always wanted to have one. No way that I have this now. And it's going to be so, so helpful for the videos because then I'm not gonna have to be pulling all the time the yarn. So it's just going to unwind by itself. I'm so excited for this. And you can see that the bottom, it rotates. I'm gonna get this yarn that I have laying around here. And we have to just insert right into this little pole here. And then all you have to do is to start crocheting and it's going to unwind for you. How incredible is this? Stop everything and let's focus on this. This is a zipper for crochet. So you basically have the zipper, but already with the holes on both sides, across the sides. So you basically just have to sew this in place into your bag, your purse that you're doing. So it's ready made for you to use. I have to open this. I have to open this because I'm so excited. This is the 20 centimeters one that I got in this beautiful shade this brown shade. Let's try it out. It works perfectly. I love that. And look at it. I love it and I cannot wait to try it out on an actual crochet project because this is so fun. I love this. Next up we have the swollen yarn. This one is 10% wool, 15% polyester, and 75% acrylic. And this one is not a super chunky, this one is a chunky yarn. In this beautiful orange shade, and I did get a lot more of this yarn. So I got in this burgundy shade. I also got in this, what color would this be? Yellow, green, mustard. I don't know. Also, I got in army green. Oh, I have another master right here. This yarn is so unique. It has kind of like a thread going into the actual strand and it looks so different. And I, I did crochet with this already and it gives the most beautiful effect to the crochet, to the stitch that you are using. You're not gonna believe how beautiful that yarn is. The tutorial is coming up soon, so stay tuned. I have another one in red with the sparkly thread. <laughs> I love you, bravissimo yarn. Guys, you don't know how much I love this yarn. It's like my baby. I love you. It matches my outfit. Do it look good? I don't know you, but I love the smell of yarns. I love smelling them. Is that weird? Maybe? <laughs> so you can see where I'm going here. So I got the silver, I got the red. And yes, we are going to be doing a lot of Christmas ornaments because that's my goal and that's what I was waiting for, for this big box to start my Christmas ornaments so I can start decorating my Christmas tree. I'm already late. Next up we have 
Very interesting. We have some sequins on this one. ASMR. So this one, so this one is the Allen Chic, and it's six percent wool, forty percent acrylic, and twenty-five percent polyester. This yarn is so so unique. I'm gonna have to open this one as well. I wish you could feel this yarn yourself because it's the softest yarn this yarn is super unique you will see the close-up i never seen anything like this before how fun is this so we have a strand in which is with the red that has like some fluff going around and then we have a thinner thread with sequins how fun is this Next up, we have more Bravismo. I got a smaller one of the Bravismo yarn. This one is the Bravismo 50, the 50 grams of the Bravismo yarn. And in the shade black, because I do wanna have this for some things that I have in mind. And I never have enough black yarn at home, so I've decided to get some. I should have gotten the bigger ball, but I just got the 50 grams. Next, we have some Thai Skinny. I have a bag that I wanna do with this, that I'm super excited about, that I wanna use some of the sets that I bought from last time. So this one is a super thin yarn, but so beautiful and perfect for crochet bags. They have a section on the website that is specially made for crochet bags. So everything that you need, for example, if you need a zip, they have for bags, if you need yarn, if you need the sets that you just wanna do the body of the bag and then you need the bottom, the, the handles, they have everything that you can think of related to bags. I didn't get a lot this time because I do have a lot at home that I wanna use. I just ordered the yarns that I needed for the bags. So next up, we have some Thai Sublime. You also know how much I love this yarn. I've done some different projects with them and they are incredible. It's kind of like a corded type of yarn. You will see the close up and it's the same with the Thai Skinny. And this range is super cool because they are all the Thai range, but they have the Skinny one, the Sublime, in which is a little bit thicker and then they have a super thick one that it's incredibly amazing. You'll not believe. If you've tried the Thai range from Tesland, you know what I mean. It's incredible. And I got in this beautiful silver shade with some sparkles as well. And I got two of each. You can already tell what I'm going to make, right? Because <laughs> look at the amount. <laughs> Some more verb, another one, another one. Now we are going to move on into some other tools that I got. The first thing I'm going to show you is this little base that I got that I'm going to be using. I think it's with this yarn that I got because the shades are pretty similar. So I'm pretty sure I have the ideas written down, but I think that I got this base to use with these two yarns Next up, we have a pair of scissors. Look at it. It's so smooth. It's the most beautiful thing I ever seen in my life. Yeah, isn't it? Isn't it the most beautiful thing I've ever seen? Are you also impressed? Because I am. Now I completely forgot what I was talking about. The engraving on this handle is just so beautiful. What is it though? Is he a dragon? Is he a peacock? Is he a chicken? I am pretty sure that one of them is a dragon, but I cannot identify the other creature in this pair of scissors. But it has a golden handle. I love this. <laughs> this is so fancy. I know you want one as well, right? All right, after my Google search, this is called Togo. Why would you call this a tog Togo? 
I, I cannot even pronounce it. <laughs> so this is what I got, a fastener for coats and jackets. I have something in mind, so I got this and I'm so excited to use because also they have the leather part right here that already has the little holes around it so you can just sew it into your crochet item super super interesting and I really wanted to give it a try so that's what I got five in total now I think you have one more clue to what is coming <laughs> next up we have the cutest little buttons ever I got some Christmas buttons with a gingerbread man with a gingerbread house I have one two three four five six seven eight buttons in total next up we have a d-ring I always always need them but I never have them so I got them <laughs> These are basically for you to attach to the sides of the bag that you make so that you can actually just create the strap or the handle that you are doing going around the ring instead of into the actual crochet. I think this gives more like a structure to the strap but also it makes it stronger in a way. So that's why I got it. Jingle bell, jingle bell. Jingle on the way. I got some jingle jinglings. I got some jingles. <laughs> some jingles. I got some Christmas jingle jingling bells. I got the blue one, the white one, the yellow one, the red one, and the green one. And this is why the box sounded like Christmas. <laughs> So I have these little rings in which they are not really rings like little circles, they are a triangle and they open and close in which I really really like them because you can actually have the straps or the handles that you are doing for your bag removable. So I got two sets, so I have four in total. Next I have two straps. I love Teslan's straps, you and handles. You have to check it out because they have the best ones. And this one I've always wanted to get and this time I did it. Isn't it the most beautiful strap you ever seen? I love the chain, this resin chain. The resin straps and handles from Teslan are my favorite. And on these ones, we have the little hooks at the bottom that they open and close so you can just slide right into your crochet bag and the strap is basically done for you. I love the marble effect on these, it's just so stunning. Next up I got this chain that we see them a lot in designer bags um, and I want to do something with it so I'm going to be having the strap with this beautiful chain and then I'm going to be having the handles made out of crochet. And also it has little hooks at the end so it makes it super easy to just attach into the bag and if you want to remove you can and then you can use in a different bag. So they are super super versatile. Also the same thing applies to this other chain that I got because it has hooks at the end you can actually reuse for another bag. So if you buy one, you're not gonna be using for only one bag. You can actually use for all the bags you make. Now the moment that I've been waiting for my entire life, you guys will be so upset with me if you love Christmas like I do, because I am upset with myself that I never done this before. Are you ready? I got an advent calendar. A Christmas one! A sewing one! Can you believe? This one is the Merry Somas limited edition Christmas advent calendar. Let's start into a colorful and creative Christmas season. Merry Christmas, Merry Christmas! And he has all the numbers around. I'm so excited. Oh! 
there is a list here at the back with all the products right there all right i'll make sure that i'll put this away that i don't see it the way that i'm feeling right now is just like a kid with a thousand sweets in front of me that i can eat all of them myself in a day this is how i feel about this advent calendar i cannot wait to open the first one this is going to be exciting because i love sewing as well maybe i can do some more sewing projects here on the channel i really want to do let me know in the comments if you want to see some sewing projects maybe then i can try the products that i have inside this advent calendar let me know so stay tuned because we are going to be having 24 because i cannot find a 25 and i think it's 24. so that was everything for my haul i really hope you have enjoyed if you have any questions let me know in the comments below everything that i have mentioned in today's haul is going to be linked in the description so feel free to check it out if you want to see any of the products that i've mentioned in today's video also stay tuned to open these massive advent calendar with me i'm going to be opening every single number with you guys over on instagram and tiktok and also shorts here on youtube so stay tuned because i'm so excited <laughs> i'm so emotional because this is my first one and also i really hope you like all the content that i have coming up using the products that i've showed you in today's video so thank you again for watching today's video i really hope you have enjoyed if you did don't forget to leave your massive thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you can watch more videos just like this one so thank you so so much again for watching and i'll see you in my next video bye bye it's christmas season <laughs>